I know, what's up? Now you know there's been some things in this relationship that I find irritating. Yeah. The one main thing is when you talk in footy jargon and I can never understand what you're saying. Yeah. It just hasn't seemed like you've made any effort to tone it back. Look babe, I told you we were taking it one week at a time. I can only focus on what I can control. Everything else is just hearsay to me. I don't listen to the outside noise. And I'm pretty keen to have a big performance this week and bounce back. You see, just like that, I, I don't understand any of that at all. And why is this about me? You do things that annoy me as well. Like what? Well, in the bedroom, you never spice it up. You're complacent, you lack effort, and sometimes your ball skills are poor. I don't spice it up. I once tried to, and you said it was kissing in danger. That's because that was out of bounds. I didn't mean it. So that's rubbish. We all know that that was deliberate. Is this because when we make love, I only have shallow inside 50s? I know your ex-boyfriend's kick was a lot bigger than mine, and he could penetrate it deeper to the hot spot, but... But I try to use my skills to be efficient. No, Caden, no, it's not that. I told you though, even though your kick isn't as big, I can still find a way to score myself. Okay, well, that's good. It's important to have other avenues to score. Can't be predictable. I'm really sorry, but I think we should break up. What the fuck is that? I want you to review your decision. It's final. I can't keep doing this. Oh well, I don't care. I've been exploring free agency anyway. Well, what does that mean? I've been talking to other suitors and they've shown plenty of interest. So you cheated? I never cheated, but I had offers put on the table that I humbly declined, but for me and my family, I think going forward, it's best if I take up these offers. Offers from who? Well, I had a sizable offer from Stacy. Stacy? Whatever, she's gross. She's rebuilding. 